welcome to another video tutorial. Um, I told you I was going to get one up quick, and today's is a request by. Um, let me just find it. Beep, beep. Here it is. DJ, DJ Anderton says, um, can you do a video explaining some ways to avoid getting spam, including in results when using search engines? Now, this was um, quite a difficult one. Um, um, I don't think I was quite able to find one way to search it, but um, I found a way you can block a load of ads, and there is like a site rating sort of thing, so it's sort of there, but it's that shows actually a way to stop sort of spam adverts, um, spam results on Google. So like, um, just like an advertising site or something. Um, the first add-on for Firefox is well, the first thing is you got to get Firefox. If you're not using Firefox, one, you suck, and two, you're missing out on a lot. As you can see, I've got all these themes for it and stuff. Um, there's all these great add-ons that you can get for it. And it's um, really nice. So the first thing, which was the site advisor, is um, by McAfee. Um, I'll give you the download link to this. Um, all you do is you go to download site advisor for Firefox. Click. I agree to these terms and conditions. And you click install site advisor for Firefox now. And um, you may get this up saying that it's um, trying to install software on the computer. You just click on allow and then try it again. So um, you get this pop up window. You just click install now. It'll start up installing and you restart Firefox and it'll open and you'll have a little thing down here and it'll look like this and if it's um, a secure website that it recognizes it'll be green like this and if it's a bad site or they're not sure about it it'll be red you can always check what it is so um, I'll just restart Firefox and I'll show you. Uh, I'll just pause the video while I restart. Right, so on the restart you'll get a screen that looks like this. And you'll click agree and continue. Now, when it's restarted, you get this little thing down here. This little thing down here. Um, and if you click on it, you can see view site details, and it'll come to this web safety rating, and it'll say we have tested this site and found it safe to use. Um, if you go on another one, let's say YouTube again, it's green tested it. Um, you could go into Google and type um, I don't know keygen.ms go here and see what it says see it's green and if it's a bad website then it'll come up as um, red you can also change the settings, disable site advisor, and if you go to, I think, I'm not sure if this works. No, I thought it did. Yeah, it'll give you this little tick here saying that it's rated and it's good. It's um, um, not going to spoil, like, give you a load of spam or anything. 
Um, the next one after that is a add-on called Adop Adblock Plus. Um, if you're on a website and you're sick of getting all these ads and stuff, um, the best way to show it is YouTube because um, it thinks it's the play is an advert even though it's not. Um, you get this little thing here and you can say to block, the others it'll just block totally. So like most ads it'll block totally but um, other ones that it's not sure about you've got the option to block it. So if there's something that's not recognized then it'll block it like see if we went to MySpace I don't think there's actually any there but if when you log into MySpace there are normally a bunch of adverts they're all removed but there's still some that you can remove after that as well and um, this comes with a list of um, ad block um, sort of like um, types of adverts and it tells you whether it's enabled and how many hits you've had for them so you can see here these are all the different things all the different types of adverts that it has already pre-installed on it and then to get a more extensive um, ad block there's um, a thing called ad block filter set G updater and this will automatic it um, installs extra lists of adverts, and um, it also updates every four to seven days of new types of adverts if there are any, which is really good and keeps everything all safe and you don't get any annoying pop-ups or adverts or stuff like that. And it's um, a really good thing to have it. I have it up here as you can see. I started using it recently, and it's um, a really good thing to have for it. Um just check the time on this. Seven minutes. Um and that should be about all you need really. Um the other thing is if you have got stumble upon installed, you can search it here if you want to. Stumble upon. If you want to you can install this and when you go and search something in Google it'll give you a rating I think oh no that's yeah here it is it'll give you a star rating of it um, which is not as good as this one but because it doesn't go as um, extensive as the McAfee site advisor but it's alright nothing it's not it's just a nice little thing that you can have on there as well um so that's about it really if um you could subscribe to my channel that'd be great um comment on my videos and if you're feeling really generous you could and um, donate to me if you really want to don't know if you you don't have to if you don't want to and it can be as much or as little as you like just send it to if you are going to on PayPal. It's um, my email is tgww123 at googlemail.com. So you can send it there if you want to, but um, it's up to you really. I'm not bothered if you do or don't. Um, main thing is you subscribe. If you subscribe, um, you're doing your bit really. Um, that's about a wrap up. Um, like I said, remember to subscribe and comment. And um, if you've got any requests, just tell me, and um, I'll try and sort them out for you.